Okay, folks, we're going to continue our training with Mika and her um, feeding etiquette, which, of course, everyone that knows my videos that follow me know that it is the cornerstone of our training. And we've been working on um, Mika watching my hands, hand signals. And so um, we'll just go ahead and get started. Mika. So I just gave her a sign to stop and sit. So. Uh. And so this was the sign to stay. Now I'm gonna give her a sign to come to me. Good girl, we go. Now here's where we've been having problems, her staying. Bad dog, Donnie. Oftentimes the other dogs, they want to work as well, because they know there's treats involved, and Donnie's a little rumbunctious. Today is September 4th. <clears throat> it is September 4th, 2019. It is about 7.35 in the morning. Cooper, Donnie, no. This is the sign for now. And we've been doing this for two weeks. Nika, down. Stay. Normally, um, I would expect this is the sign for a for dog to have caught on to this by now. But we work at the dog's pace. Sometimes it takes a little bit more patience. So I'll give her the command again. And now I'm going to move over there, camera person. So I'll move in several different places, in different spaces, so that she gets used to doing the same thing no matter where I'm standing. Ruby out. Now we'll proceed with the feeding. I'm going to go ahead and give her a command to sit up. See, she moves. So I'll put her back in her space again. And all of this stuff to the left side works with the leash etiquette. And that's why we want to keep her on our left. Time to stay. I'll go into another room to get her water. And what that does is <clears throat> That's a part of the separation anxiety thing. So she actually has food that she's hungry, she's waiting for water, and I'm actually leaving the room. I'll just say it one more time. Mika, stay.
Okay, I back with the water. No one tells she's looking at me, and this is what I want. She's gonna wait for a signal from my hands. And she stood up. And folks, just so you know, by now she should pretty much have this. But once again, we will work at her pace and just have to be patient. We're taking a few years of bad habits out of her to get her to relearn some other things. And she's actually doing pretty good for a dog that's um, as stubborn as she is. That's that.